Hello everyone and welcome back to Sparks of Knowledge where we explore the world of programming and technology. In today's video, we are going to create a simple weather forecast application using Python and the Kinte library. It's a great example of how Python can be used for creating practical and user-friendly applications. This application will allow you to check the current weather in any city around the world with just a few clicks right from your computer. If you have ever wondered how to build a graphical user interface application with Python or how to fetch real-time weather data from the internet, this video is for you. We will be using the Kinter library for the GUI and the Open Weather Map API to retrieve weather information. So whether you are a beginner looking to learn some new programming skills or an experienced developer looking for a practical project, you are in the right place. Let's start by breaking down the code step by step. We begin by importing the necessary libraries including filter for the GUI and request for making API requests. We also use the photo image class to display an image in the application. To fetch weather data, we have a get weather function. This function constructs some URL with the user's input city and sends a request to the open weather map API. It then processes the JSON response to extract temperature, description, humidity and wind speed. As you can see, we have customized the appearance of our application. We have set background colors, fonts and button styles to make it visually appealing. City label is a label widget that displays enter city and has a white background. City entry is an entry widget where the user can input the city name. It's styled with the specified width and font. Get weather button is a button widget labeled get weather that triggers the get weather function when clicked. It's styled with a blue background, white text and specific dimension. Result label is a label widget initially displaying weather forecast. It has a light purple background and a bold font and is left justified. Image label is a label widget used for displaying an image with the .png. It's positioned at the bottom and it expands to fill available space. The background is set to olive green. This line starts the main event loop of the Kintel application which keeps the GUI running and responsive to user interaction. Overall, the code creates a GUI application for checking weather information based on user input. It fetches weather data from an API and updates the GUI weather results, while also providing a visually appealing interface with styling and an image. I hope you found this video helpful and enjoyed creating this weather forecast application with me. Python and Kinter make it relatively easy to build user-friendly applications like this. If you have any questions or suggestions, feel free to leave them in the comments below. Thank you for watching this video on creating a weather forecast application in Python. If you found it useful, please don't forget to like, share and subscribe to Sparks of Knowledge for more programming tutorials and projects. Have a great day.